So I'm having so much fun with this Marble Fun Run 105. Um, opened it up with my kids earlier today and we're just having a blast. Just thought I'd show you some of the pieces. Oh, looks like my cat's interested too. Um, it's really, you know, come a long way from the marble runs I remember when I was a kid. Um, comes with a nice bag of uh, multicolored marbles. Uh, perfect size to, to fit down the track. I like that some of the pieces are kind of complex. You've got um, these little extra pieces that the parent can just easily snap in. They come separately, like here. These, you know, spin as the marble goes down, which the kids love. These ones with the little paddle wheels. Also, um, the, the orange piece and the red piece are separate and just uh, easy for a parent to snap on. Or you can just use the green piece um, as, a, as a long diagonal. Actually, we've got one in here that I haven't attached the wheel to. These um, top pieces are also really cool because it's got, I'll show you a, a little thing where you can put the marble in and then release it by kind of uh, lifting the latch. I think that's cool. The kids really like that. Um, it's got all the classic, you know, S-shape, funnels, um, squiggly, just uh, lots of different, you know, fun options. And it's cool also that all the connector pieces are clear. They're this um, pink sparkly clear so that you can see the, the marbles going through. Um, rather than, well, it does come with uh, instructions for a setup that can use, you know, all the pieces in a very complex way. Rather than do that, we decided to just have fun trying to build something that would uh, would work. And I'm uh, actually pretty pleased with the results. Let's see, let me get a couple of marbles out here and I can show show you uh, what we did. So there's one loop-de-loop -loop piece, which is pretty cool. You usually have to assemble it. This The top part of the curve is a separate piece of plastic that just is easy to snap on. Everything else here is pretty self-explanatory. So the way these work here, you can put a marble in and just keep it there until you're ready to go. So my kids and I, we were having fun by doing races, by having each of my kids um, flip the lever uh, at the same time and see which marble would get to the bottom first. I'll just show you each of the paths that uh, we've set up here. A look at this one. My cat here is very interested as well. All right, very cool. Okay, let's try this even taller track here. Yeah, cool. You know, uh, got so much energy that time on the loop-de-loop, -loop, it actually fell fell off and didn't go into the base. But you know, that's actually I think part of the good learning experience for kids is that um, you know the physics of it that it's not always reproducible every single time. It's, uh, Try this tall track one more time just to show you. This one's really fun. There we go. See, in that time it landed right in the base like it normally does. So really, we're having a lot of fun with this. There's just so much uh, flexibility uh, and creativity that my kids can have with all these pieces. So definitely this um, marble Fun Run 105 I think is well designed. Um, my seven-year-old was uh, able to put the pieces together fairly easily. My four-year-old needed some help, but that's to be expected with this kind of set. So uh, definitely a lot of fun.